Hello, this is Russell Minden. We're doing another video on safe money places with using fixed annuities. This video is about safety. What makes fixed annuities safe? Just how are they safe? Well, I always like to answer the question about safety, which is always a very valid question when we talk safe money man, safe money places. Well, what is safety? What makes them safe? Well, first, there's four levels of safety that I always like to talk about. The first level is the insurance contract or the policy itself. And this is one that I, I myself own, which I got in the mid 90s. The contract spells out all the levels of guarantees of your principal, guarantees of minimum interest rates. If it's in the contract, the company's gonna do it. The contracts are important. The second level of safety will come from the actual insurance company itself. What are the financial ratings of the insurance company? How stable are they? How long they've been in business? Uh, there are rating agencies that rate insurance companies such as AM Best, Standard & Poor's, and others. So we look at the ratings and the financial, overall financial strength. Who's their parent owner? Uh, third level of safety would be the State Guarantee Association. The insurance industry is regulated by the states, not the federal government, which to me is a positive. So uh, the Guarantee Association works similar to FDIC but it's a little bit different, but it's similar to that in that every person has $250,000 of coverage for any money they put into a deferred annuity per person per insurance company. So the fourth level of safety or guarantees uh, come from, to me, the actual history of fixed annuities. To my knowledge, not one person has ever lost a dollar of principal on a fixed annuity from any financial difficulty that particular insurance company might have, uh, have had. So you have four levels of safety. The actual contract itself spells out what's guaranteed in the contract. The insurance company backing the contract. The state guarantee association. And then the fourth would be the actual history of the overall safety of fixed annuities. So that's my recap on just how safe are they and what makes them safe. Be sure to watch future videos. Thank you.